welcome back. We are working on free candy. Uh, Scott's having a fight with the Jack. Who's winning? You or the Jack? Well, I mean, all the shit back there is kind of lost, but... Sorry. Yeah. So, what we're going to be doing today or into tomorrow, because... I don't know. Um, we have some drop spindles. Um, that we're going to put on here to drop the nose a bit. So... We got Scott on the jack here, and we got to slide it over a little bit, so we got room to work on it for the other side. And um, so it should be pretty exciting. Um, yeah, let's get to it. We'll uh, get this thing jacked up, uh, sitting safely, and then we'll come right back to you. So we got the old spindle off, um, not too exciting, but we will film doing it next time. We had to use the negotiator here um, to get it, but this is the drop spindle that's going on now. Pretty easy operation. Um, basically, you just got to uh, strip the brakes off like you're doing a brake job and uh, take the uh, rotor off and then uh, take the um, tie rod off and then um, break the ball joints and pull it off. What we did was, for safety, we put a chain around the, um, yeah, around the, uh, I think so. around the spring. This way, uh, yeah. just in case the jack slips or something, you know, the uh, spring come and hit you in the chest. Yeah, these springs, uh, they fly. Yeah, they will. And uh, just gotta be safe, because, uh, hey, What's, I want to see what it looks like when it's lowered. We realized that uh, we didn't film a whole lot on the passenger side, so. Should I use the little hammer? Yeah, we're gonna use the little hammer. Okay. So basically all we did here, nothing crazy. We uh, went through, we took the brakes off. Well, tire, brakes, brakes are just here and here. And tie rod end. And wrapped the cane through the spring, just to play it safe. Cotter pins out. Loosen these pretty much so that they're, the castle nuts are flat. And now Kevin's gonna whack the snot out of this until that drops down. And I'm gonna watch him and relax. Yes. And I got the jack down like half an inch. There we go. All right. Oh shit. Oh. And we lost the solder. Um, yes. Okay, so now we're gonna bring these down like halfway. Whack it again. Is the other one down? Uh, no. All right. Is there still this jack still kind of loose? Let me find out. Ah, uh, I can go down a hair. Yeah, go down a hair. Okay, hold on. Let me. Uh... Okay, now the jack's kind of okay. loose. So now Kevin's gonna whack the top, I think. Drop? Yep, I think so. Okay. All right, those pins are in. I retain it better if it takes longer. Old school or preschool? Whatever helps me remember. <laughs> this is definitely my first set of... No, it's not my first set of drop spindles on a G10 van. You know, it's funny. There's some orange on these drop spindles. I wonder why. Oh. Poor prep work. I think when we painted your van, I was in charge of uh, covering uh, everything. Mm-hmm. 
Because, yeah, when we painted the van, we pulled the rims. We yeah. Pull the suspension out. Yeah. But we had the uh, junky wheels on it. Did Which? we? Or, or did we put it all the way to the floor? I can't remember. Uh, we put it all the way to the floor. Oh, that was for the roof, though. But then, yeah, I don't know. That whole thing was a blur, man. Okay. Um, Is it spinning? It's spinning. Okay. All right. Use the air gun. Give it a, try oh. to zip it? Yeah, try to zip it. Okay. Might, might uh, make it go quicker. I don't know if we have any pressure, but we'll, yeah, we got pressure. Oh, it's going. It's seated. Fucking tight now. Yeah. Okay. It's a little tight, but I'm gonna loosen her up. Yeah, if you could loosen it up to the whatever hole lines up, then you're good. I can go to the next hole right there. Ooh. Well, I didn't get it. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Uh, slobber that up a little bit. That's a lot of it, isn't it? That's a lot of it. Sorry. We need lubrication for the whole, you know, 40 miles I'm going to put on it in a year. Mm hmm. Now I'm going to clean my hands before I grab this rotor. Mm hmm Okay. Oh, oh, be real careful with that seal. There it is. There it is. No, oh, you didn't drop it this time into the dirt. Mm. Hey, I'm not done. <laughs> now I didn't the, drop it. Now we're good. Is that the white castle nut? <laughs> That's the one that did not get dropped in all the dirt. Yeah. All right. Impact. Fucking mm -hmm. drive this bitch home. Uh, no. Oh, that's right. We need the... Uh, uh, metric, the metric, uh, metric SAE, metric SAE adapter, uh, sir torques a lot. And this is an any millimeter, mm -hmm. whatever millimeter you need it to be. All right. All right. So we got the brakes on. We didn't film that because it's, uh, Couple pads, caliper, and some bolts. We are gonna film putting the wheel on though. That's Yay. exciting. Okay, you can stop recording. Cause that's I am recording. <laughs> <laughs> now get your nuts. Well, we're just getting to the exciting part, the part that you're looking forward to. I'm looking forward to putting this. You just wanna drop this, this bitch. As hard as possible. Well, not as hard as Remember, possible. Remember, man, she's old. We don't want the motor to fall out. Ooh, that, that would be cool. For you, you're going home in three days. Did you guys see this motor? Look yeah. how nice that looks. Scott did a nice job in there. Captain Spray Paint. Uncle Tony's uh, uh, paint style. Yes. yes Uncle know. Tony's garage, isn't that, is that what it is? Something like that. Yeah. He uh, showed the process on what paint to use and how to do it, and uh, boy, it it looks it looks sharp. Yeah, rust oleum, rusty metal primer, and then uh, like just tractor paint, rust oleum tractor paint. Yeah, I mean it flowed out nice. I'm gonna paint my '57 Chevy with that stuff. I think we have to see how DD's comes out. Well, yeah. I'm not gonna say anything on camera, but yeah. <laughs> oh 
I have more pain. I have more pain experience than him, though. Yeah. Okay. All right. We don't know what we're recording because the GoPro kind of went skitzy, but everything's on. Tires back on. We're ready to lower it. All right. Hopefully Here's nothing me. hits. Oh, it's a good stance. Oh, you like it? I so far. I, 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 oh yeah. Oh yeah. It, it's yeah. It's where it's, it's where it's supposed to be now. Yeah. Yeah. This is where it always should have been. We're not gonna have any problems here. No, we got plenty. Flares will be out there. Yeah, we're good. Uh, open the door and jump in there a little bit. Jump on the on the sill. I watch the. This thing will be great, man. We got some stink bug action. <laughs> wow, it, it just feels so much lower now. At the front, right? Well, standing at the front. Well, hopefully both sides are symmetrical. We'll measure that, and if they're not, then we'll, you know, pretend we didn't measure it. That's yeah. Cool. Okay. All right. So, what do you think, Kev? Happy? I'm happy, man. My my thing is, I want you happy, and I think you are happy. Yeah. All right, guys. This looks right. I mean, this is yeah. what the van should be. Yeah. You know? And then, the, you know, the back's up a little bit high right now, but there's nothing in the van right now. So that'll come down a little bit. But honestly, I, you might want to put something there and keep it up a little bit. Oh, uh, no. You know, it's got the three inch blocks in the back. So the front might settle down a little more, even too. So. Hey, if it does, it does. If it doesn't, it, it's, it doesn't matter. No, it, it's, it's fine. It, yep. This is pretty much where mine is. Yeah. You know, especially when I put air in the back. So. All right. Well, I think that's a that's, that's a wrap for this video. This is a nice short video. Yeah. Getting in the van's gonna be easier too. You know. Yeah, I am a short guy. Oh, this thing was really high. Yeah, it was. Because I mean, if you guys remember the video, I don't know. If, did we video it at all, or did I when it had the stock wheels on it? I don't know. Um, sorry, I like the very the first one. That were on it were like four by four. Yeah, they were thirty ones. Or way so. it was big yep all right guys so uh, i think that's gonna do it for this video you know nice short easy hopefully this helps you out and if you decide to uh more cool stuff coming up because i'm not gonna tell you at all what we're doing but i came up with this idea that uh stemmed off of scott's idea and i but it added a little bit and that's all i'm gonna it, say it may or may not work if it works you'll it's see a gonna, video it's gonna work if it doesn't work then you won't know anything it's going to work. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe and tell your friends. Take care. Look at this beauty, man. So powerful. It broke my $6 battery strap. Damn.